Today we, we hear about Amalek attacking Israel. And Moses intervenes, and as long as Moses has his hands raised, Israel has a better part of the battle. But when his hands get tired, Amalek has an upper hand. So her and Aaron hold up Moses' hands so Israel can be victorious. And you see, Moses' hands get tired. And so it is with us when we're carrying a carrying the cross, our shoulders, our arms get tired of carrying that cross. And sometimes we want to give up. But when we we start to give up, we give in to sin. We're more susceptible to sin in our earthly journey. Jesus also carried the cross. And Jesus fell. Several times he fell on the way to Calvary. But he remained faithful. He remained faithful because of his love for you and for me. And we have to remember that if Jesus was faithful to God and to us, we should also be faithful to God because as the responsorial song says, our help comes from the Lord who made heaven and earth. It talks about, it just talks about being persistent, being persistent in prayer and not to give up. We have to be persistent we have to be patient in our suffering and we have to persevere in our prayer life. We have to be persistent like the widow in the gospel who never gave up. And finally, the judge rendered a favorable verdict against her adversary. So we too have to be persistent, have to pray without being weary. In the letter to Timothy, it talks about, reminds us of how important sacred scripture is. Sacred scripture. It says, proclaim the word of God. Be persistent, whether it's convenient or inconvenient. Convince, reprimand, encourage in patience and in teaching. Because the Word of God will give us that wisdom, that wisdom that we need. So at the end of our earthly journey, we can gain that prize. It talks about that prize, that prize of salvation, that prize of eternal life. <coughs> so we must remember to, to pray, pray without, without getting weary so that we can get that prize of eternal life. Amen. Amen. Amen.